Hey guys, Silence Zero here. Welcome back to another video of Kingdom Hearts Unchained Key on the Japanese server. So we are going to continue the Maleficent uh, medal event. And yeah, um, we are right now on stage 6. Uh, just a few more rounds to go before the end of the entire thing. And okay, the challenges for the uh, this time round, it's basically to use two reverse medals within your Keyblade setup and uh, you have to use the power of Hero um, Keyblade. So let me just check my Keyblade setup to see whether I do have two reverse medals on the power of Keyblade, which is Olympia. Alright, so... Um, Hmm, I have nothing equipped at all. <laughs> Alright, so just gonna get down to slotting in something. Uh, probably this too, and that's it. Alright, so... Where's, where's my Sebastian? So, pretty simple I guess, uh, considering that I have quite a few key medals on hand. Uh, but, if you guys are still new to the game and just starting out, um, honestly, there is no rush to complete all the events, uh, especially since you're already uh, joining the game uh, this late. So play at your own pace, do what you can with your best of your abilities and just achieve what you're able to. And yeah, eventually, sooner or later, who knows, there will be another anniversary event and uh, you'll probably see um, event medals returning again, I guess. Well, we can always speculate, but who knows, you know. So, yeah, um, alright, let's get down to the stage itself. Uh, I'm just gonna go with anything this round. Okay, so... Hmm... I'm still not too sure what's the difference between the top and bottom lanes, but uh, I guess it's not really that big of a difference. Alright, so just checking again, no continue clear. So nothing really special except for equipping a lot of uh, required stuff. Yep. So, the objectives for the event is not exactly very difficult, uh, it's not like those time-based events or uh, you need to do a certain amount of damage or you need to have activated a certain skill. Uh, this is really really like a walk in a park compared to those kind of objectives available. So, I guess we have to thank Square Enix for making it easier, I guess. Uh, I just hope I won't regret <laughs> my words later on. Alright, so we got our second Maleficent medal. Uh, I'll probably do a video to show you guys how she ends up after being guilted. So... Yeah, I'm just gonna skip the great boss, and that's not the key point of the video, I guess. So, moving on to stage 7. Uh, so, I have to equip 3 reverse medals now in order to clear the first one. And I have to use Desire Lamp, so let's get down to adjusting the Keyblade. So, Desire Lamp is basically the Arabian uh, Keyblade. So, hmm. let me see... Alright, I'm still going to use this empty slotted one. Uh, one reverse medal. I need a second one. Just going to put it in. Terra, in you go. Yep, this the. Hmm. So which is actually higher? This or this? <laughs> oh well, whatever. I'm just going to slot it in. <laughs> okay. I don't really have anything much to boost for magic, so I guess I'm just gonna go with like this. Where's my Sebastian? There we go. So Sebastian is always a must for me. Um, well, it is. He is currently one of the most awesome 
uh, supportive medals at this point of time. So uh, if you guys, uh, if we eventually get the Little Mermaid event in the US side, I would definitely recommend getting Sebastian at all costs. Uh, especially if he retains his exact uh, ability or skill. So yeah. Alright, let's go in. So, at this point in time, if you are a free to play player and then just starting out, I think you'll probably be facing some difficulties around the heartless of level 150 and above. Uh, I remember the days when I did struggle a lot with Heartless at this level but uh, yeah eventually you get um, better I guess uh, and with the, the luck of obtaining powerful medals so yeah don't give up that's the main point of the, uh, this game uh, well, any Japanese game actually, uh, the morals of the standard, I believe in friendship and there, uh, I shouldn't give up, there's always hope to the last minute, so yeah, hmm, alright, so there we go, stage 7 done. As you can see, I'm not doing so well with my magic setup. Um, wait, what? Oh, it's three! I didn't include three! Okay, never mind. I probably have to do that again off screen. Okay, that was my bad. My bad. <laughs> Wasn't really paying attention. Even after I read it out. Okay, so. Um, objectives, uh, challenges for stage 8, basically 3 reverse medals, okay I'm going to change my medal setup and we have to use the Keyblade Last Resort, so let's go down to equipping Last Resort uh, okay I'm just going to change, I have 2 here, so I just need 1 more reverse, I'm just going to slot this guy in and there we go Alright, so getting down to the event itself. Alright, so here's our chance to take a look at the uh, Halloween Town Sora. If you guys have not, I mean, if you guys are lucky enough to obtain it, uh, if you guys haven't, well, here's a chance to take a look at what it does. Honestly, this medal is not a very powerful one, but I have taken notice of one thing that it's good for. Um, it's awesome for clearing speed events, basically those that you need to clear in a certain amount of time. So why? So uh, why do I say that? So we'll, we'll take a look at the, the medal itself and let's see whether we can um, see how useful it is. Alright, so take a look at how fast this guy moves. So, I'm not too sure whether it's faster than most of the the medals out there, but the animation speed was ridiculously fast. Uh, and that's the main thing that really captured my eye for this medal. Other than that, it's not a very powerful medal, but still, it's a medal that is really, really fast. And yeah, uh, all I can say is it could be... Uh, but, uh, a useful medal to clear speed challenges. See? So fast, oh my goodness. It's like having Speedy Gonzalez in your Keyblade. Well, Speedy Gonzalez is not under Disney, so... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Any fast-moving characters in Disney? <laughs> um, cars? I know. I don't know. Um... <laughs> No oh, Disney Pixels, I guess. Huh. Okay, so 
Uh, as you can see, my speed medals are not that well to do, and I'm kind of struggling already. Oh uh, no. So I, I, I definitely won't be able to clear everything in one turn. Oh wait! I take that back. Halloween Sora, you saved my Tushi! <laughs> Alright, awesome! Okay, moving on to stage 9. Okay, so still using 3 reverse medals in the Keyblade and... So I think the Keyblade's name is Rock Splendor. I think I finally got it right, Rock Splendor. <laughs> so it's actually the um, the power keyblade that belongs to the Seven Dwarfs. Yeah, Rock Splendor, I guess. So three reverse medals. Hmm. All right, so I'm just gonna slot them in. Uh, reverse medals. I think I don't have any. Oh wait, I do have a reverse power. Uh, I think that's about it. Huh? I don't. Ha oh my! I don't really have a lot of reverse power medals. Okay, so I'm just gonna use whatever I have. Uh, yeah. Um, just making sure that I actually can defeat. Certain heart pluses. All right, so there we go. All right, stage nine. In we go. Let's see. It's gonna bring, huh? Okay, so I guess we probably seen most of the medals already. Um, I'm not sure whether I've shown you guys Sora and Riku from Chain of Memories or even the Key Arts 3. I can't recall. I've made too many videos on Kingdom Hearts already and I've lost count. Uh, oh well, so let's just go with whatever. Okay, so um, I would say most people would probably be starting to struggle, um, especially if you don't have proper medals to face um, the challenges. And, but if you play uh, long, as long as me, or even longer than me. Uh, you probably should be able to get past. Oh no, I did not activate. Okay, you should probably be able to get past up to this point of time. Um, after all, the events don't require you to one kill, uh, one turn finish all the heartlesses. So it should be fine. Uh, as long as you have defensive medals like uh, Queen Mini or any of the medals that actually can uh, heal you and they have the skill defense up. Or uh, even defense one, two, or three. So yeah, uh, we got our third Maleficent medal. So surprisingly slow. I'm just hoping that this event isn't very long, cause um, usually events like this they will tend to give you seven medals to fully guilt your the event medal. So yeah. Uh, okay. So right after the stage, we actually got another Maleficent as a object a challenge prize. So I have to equip four reverse medals now, uh, and it's okay. It's getting a lot uh, annoying because of the reverse medal requirements. So I have to use Mughal of Glory, which I only have three slots. <laughs> oh boy! So I could separate this challenge, uh, this stage into two tries. 
uh, basically completing the first one with another Keyblade, then obtaining the uh, the Mugo of Glory challenge with, by using Mugo of Glory in another try. So it depends on how you want to go about it. So I'm just going to go with the main objective of getting the Maleficent Medal. So I'm just going to use whatever Keyblade that I have on now. And I'm just going to slot in. There we go. And head on to the event. Alright, so stage 10, in we go, and we need a magic medal to help us out. So Terra, here we go. So I'm not too sure whether you guys have actually obtained this. Um, if you guys have actually obtained it, uh, good for you. Uh, sadly to say, I did not get one. Uh, I didn't rank high enough, I guess. Oh well, uh, maybe I'm wrong. I didn't check my um, medal stash. I can't really remember. Okay, so I'm just gonna go down. Hopefully, Terra does his job. Okay. So, at stage 10, you're facing level 200 Heartlesses. Uh, you probably might want to start. Uh, prepping your keyblades better um, especially if you aren't a veterinarian player or a long time player but who knows maybe you have the luck with metal pools and you've got something some awesome arsenal under your collection right now so yeah uh, but still the fun of the game comes to when you have to think and strategize your metal setup to break through the objectives so all right so i guess yeah that's about it for stage 10 and with this we obtain our fourth maleficent medal uh Alright, so I guess the next video will probably end this event for me. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video uh, probably tomorrow um, from the day you watch this one. So, yeah. And I wish you guys all the best to break beyond stage 10. And until then, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.